the um, genetically modified organism, as uh, that term as it's currently used, uh, really refers to organisms created through genetic engineering. And most often it means introducing genes that are not within um, the species pool. The bacteria shoots genes into the plant. The plant grows a big tumor that makes this really weird compound that only agrobacterium can eat. And so agrobacterium sets up its own little food factory. So this natural disease is really the basis for a lot of genetic engineering we do today. Um, people figured out that this process happened. Um, they learned how to take the disease-causing genes out of the transferred DNA and learned how to replace them with genes of interest. So we still use agrobacterium. We put the genes we want in. Agrobacterium delivers the DNA into the plant cells where the plant cells go ahead and use it. And what's the difference between engineering and the natural disease is we've taken the disease-causing genes out and replaced them with genes that we're interested in. The genetically engineered chili is being made through a process called cisgenics, where researchers isolate and then reintroduce a gene from the same species. Though at first seemingly less controversial, the process still involves foreign bacteria, antibiotics, test tubes, and has no guarantee of placing the gene or its promoter anywhere near its original place in the DNA chain.